covering education. Today is not only the final day of the school year, but the final day ever for two local charter schools. RTV6's Ann Kelly was there as kids showed up for the last day and found out what the future holds for all of them. Good evening. While the two schools closing as of today, University Heights Preparatory Academy on the south side and Fall Creek Academy here at Fall Creek and Capital on the north side. Now, we told you back in January, Ball State not renewing either of their charters, they say, because of poor academic performance. So the people inside this building, the students, the teachers, they've had six months to get ready for this day. So the question, are they ready? Well, in talking with the assistant principal, she told me most of the children who went here, they have a new school lined up. They're going to private schools, their local township schools, or in some cases, another charter. As far as staff, 50 to 60 percent have found new jobs. Many others are interviewing for positions, so things are moving ahead. Still, though, this morning she predicted a tough day was in store. Our school really is a family. Uh, the teachers are family. The kids are family. It is a little bit different. I expect a little more, more tears. A lot of our kids have been here since, you know, first, second grade um, and have gone all the way through high school. So I expect that it's going to be very emotional, especially for our upperclassmen. Um, but at the same time, they're really excited about their future. And Williams added that she wants everyone to know that while the school is being shut down due to academic performance issues, and while it may be too little too late, scores have gone up here, and she expects that they will once again once this year's scores are in. Reporting from the north side, Ann Kelly, RTV6.